everybody, uh, to all my Newcastle United fans all over the world. As you can see, I ventured outside uh, with my work, uh, getting to Stoke, the Stoke game on Saturday. As I predicted last week on the NUFC fans uh, website, the uh, Google Hangout, uh, Remy would not be fit. Uh, obviously, after Pardew said he was going to be scanned and he said he's, he's looking to be fit, I kind of knew that he wouldn't be because obviously every time uh, Alan Pardew comes out and says something he wants as a positive it, it normally never ends up that way so um, I can't the only thing I, with it being stoked this weekend uh, the only um, th thing I can think of is going to play Shola up front with uh, Cissé just for the fact that uh, Dijon's like plays like a bag of bag of wind in my opinion brings nothing to the game um, I don't think Dubuish is going to be back I'm not even sure about Krull. Krull's got a chance, I believe. So, um, after the last couple of weeks of being hammered 4 0 in the last three games, uh, it could be the unwanted uh, fourth time on the bounce for us. Uh, you have to hope it won't be, but uh, uh, I'm going to go with a 3 0 Stoke win uh, because we've got no pace up front. Because uh, no matter what happens with Stoke, they're, they're going to make us play, they're going to make us decide whether. We are Newcastle United team that plays with passion or plays that we've we been playing the last couple of months like gutless fools, no passion, uh, no dedication to the job. I'd rather, have a, I'd rather have 11 players in the YTS in our team at the moment. That's how bad it's getting. Uh, so I'm going to go with a 3-0 uh, win to Stoke. You can also catch us, catch me and all the various folks, Steve Wraith, uh, Smifter and uh, various other people on the NUFC fans website, the Google Hangout, where we look forward to seeing your views on Twitter, because I'm sure you're going to have a few of them after the way the, la the last week's been. So uh, here's home to a win of some sort to make sure that we can hold our head up, because uh, the way Newcastle have been playing, uh, they make that virtually impossible for us to be uh, happy in our daily life. Uh, if you look at the fanzines, Taylor and Bestie, uh, it's going all of them. Uh, all, you know, they're, they're all saying what we're all feeling. Uh, it's time for the Wave fans, I think, to actually make our voices heard tomorrow. They're paying a lot of money, and if we get whacked, uh, you know, you've got to start to make yourself heard, you United fans. All right, so sit. hopefully we'll, I'll be happy and cheerful tomorrow night uh, when the Google Hangout. So hope to see you then. Thanks now. Bye.